Karibu kwa taarifa zetu tuanze katika chuo kikuu cha Nairobi ambapo hafla maalum ya kumbukumbu ya Profesa Mishere Mugo inaandaliwa. Profesa Mugo aliaga dunia mnamo Juni tarehe 30 nchini Marekani. Aliwahi kuwa mwanafunzi katika chuo hicho na kisha baadaye kuwa mhadhiri na kuteuliwa mwanamke wa kwanza kuwa mkuu wa kitivo cha masomo ya sanaa katika chuo hicho. Hebu tusikilize yanayoendelea hivi sasa. I witnessed Professor Mishere Mogo Mogo's presence in the world because of my own privileged position of being a scholar and a writer and translator early in my life. So I've managed to meet Professor Mishere Mogo in very many parts of the world and seen just how profound her impact is on people. She has impacted me and I've seen so many others of us. She has planted flourishing seeds in academia, in the struggle for justice, and in the lives of thousands of people whom she touched in positive ways. We are consoled that the towering and shining figure of Professor Mishere Mugo, Mishere Gidai Mugo, dedicated all her life towards lifting up, lifting us up so that we may also do as much to others. We know Mishere went to be in a better place where there is no more pain. After she has, we want to believe she has done what she was created to do. When I was listening to the tributes again in Syracuse, similar tributes which I have heard here were being said about my sister. So she's not only a Kenyan, she is an, uh, a global citizen. Everyone from e every corner of this globe talked as if they knew her personally, as I'm saying. And I was really very, very grateful to God for Michelle's life. I know that our beloved daughter of the soil is smiling at us from heaven and cheering us on. And so I urge all of us to individually and collectively continue to uphold her ideals of Utu, Ubuntu, the African Renaissance, as well as education and justice for all. May professors so rest in eternal peace and may her legacy continue to stand with us and may we also continue to stand with Mombi and the rest of the family.